Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, whatever the hell it is on your end of the world. It's evening for me and it's satisfactory time. I hope things are working. <sighs> good evening, right? It's a good evening. It's a national holiday tomorrow, so that kind of changes things a bit. I don't know. I guess, does everyone else or anyone else in the other country celebrate? I think it's the resurrection of Christ. Whatever. I don't know. We're here. We are in Factorial. No, we're not. We're in Satisfactory. And we are going to figure out what we're going to do today. So, let's start by figuring out what we did last time. Yeah, in April. So that must be a different Christ than we have here, but that's fine. I don't really put much effort or much uh, focus on that. All right, so let's look at what we did last time. Here. Well, we got our quartz coming back. So one of the options we have today is making something with the quartz that we spent many a long hour getting back here to our base maybe get it out on there somewhere for a nice location um, a new tower can new chairs here <laughs> or or we could go out exploring and with the exploration we could go oh the intention of the exploration is finding more uh, hard drives i'm kind of leaning towards building the tower because i don't know because I guess I want a tower. I should be around this height. See, this is too high, but it fits with stuff over there. How is that aligned to something else? I don't know. Doesn't matter. I don't think it really matters where it's aligned to. I think maybe out here would be a good location. Like this. Yeah. I guess we can do that. What are you guys uh, thinking? And another question. Are you uh, playing Satisfactory still? Still finding it interesting and relevant? And I guess, well, my... The new... Uh, what is it? It was supposed to be an April release and a May release, right? And the April release went into experimental whoa on i did get it yeah experimental on 30th of april and then went into the main branch mid may and that's why they called it ended up calling it may release which means the end of they want to go they want to get it out into the main branch before the end of june because all of sweden shuts down during july like completely shuts down and that means they need, I would say, at least two weeks on the experimental. Which means at the latest mid-June is when they can they can release uh, release it on experimental, the next tier. That's how I right. Use explosive to clear this area. No, that makes no sense for a multitude of reasons. First of all, because I don't have explosives. That, that's kind of primary reason. Second of all, why? This is fine. I have a tough time seeing the explosives would be faster. But then again, I haven't tried it, so maybe. But I don't have a, an explosive tower. An explosive tower? Crazy. Right. I'm starting to suspect that maybe is chat dead? We here? Anyone? About to say, I feel like I'm sitting here talking to myself, which I guess is kind of the essence of being a streamer. Ah, there's someone here. Hammerstruck. Good evening. I still play the game. Awesome. Run. Ah, that pilot. That's sorry. Sorry to hear that. Where do we want the tower? I think we'll keep it at this level, even though the, it's going down now. Do we... Huh. 
How far do we want to go? Oh, that doesn't work. Here? Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Would this be a good corner? Does it go that way? No, not really. It goes a bit this way as well. So I think we'll do this one. Then figure out how far we can go this way before it encroaches. There. So this will now be determined as our corner, maybe. So let's try it. Here we go. This is the quartz tower, or is it a quartz tower, or is it? I think it's actually a quartz tower. Four, five, six, five, six. It's not going to be a very interesting tower. Well, actually, it might be an interesting tower. Two, three. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's pretty good, pretty good. It is not aligned to that one, but that's intentional, I guess. Let's try it. That one, that one. Hey, Binary Codex Gaming. Good to see you as well. Uh, I just started a new game in the jungle where there are four pure iron nodes, a pure copper node, and a pure node for concrete. Yeah, that's a nice place. Three, four, five, six. What? Oh, crap. I ran out. All right, that's counting this way. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's actually going to be pretty nice, I guess. It will be a bit floaty to start with, but... Um, We'll, uh, we'll find out. Oops, it's actually here. So this one will make the quantum something something. You know, you can really tell I... I put a big effort into understanding and knowing all the new things. Not even new, they're just... Uh, Eagle Wolf, are we... Uh, are you having fun? It's like the third time your uh, writing is hosting you. Playing with your uh, stream setup. And good evening, Hub. Have you experienced any late game lag yet? Not really. Uh, in my old base, there was some, but not much. That was a lot of save game latency. That, uh, that was pretty bad, but not really anything just during normal gameplay. My favorite starting area is an area that has four pure to pure. Yeah, binary codex, uh, that must be the northern forest. Northern Forest is just so much better than any of the other ones. It's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. Oh, Samoa, we'll take it. Absolutely. Why not? I hope the next release will be bigger than the previous one because, on the other hand, it was actually quite a lot of things that came out. The whole sulfur chain, and so we'll get an aluminium chain. Aluminium chain? No, 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 no. Not that one. You know, I might as well take these trees out because they are going to get cleared. So I might as well clear them now. They will not be long for this world. Yeah, so almost. Hey, yeah, it's been gone for some time. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Do not apologize for being gone for some time, and I wouldn't say you've been gone for so long. It hasn't been that long, it's not even been a week or so. It's just been a few streams maybe where you just checked in and said, hello, and then went out again. That's totally fine. 
I mean, anything is fine. Good. We need stuff. And we need to get rid of stuff as well. Alright, let's jump. Uh, that's fine. That shouldn't take any... Really? Okay, don't run with the chainsaw. That's a good... See, now I can't put it down there. Mm. Okay, let's move back. The wolf is still here. Okay, good. Look at this. It's just starting gradually, slowly. Uh, this one should have a pathetic amount of something. Why do you not have a pathetic amount of something coming out? That's very stuck. Very stuck. Ah, something is not working. Is it... Oh, there they are. Choking, choking, choking on the fact that there are no rotors. We really should fix the rotors. It's just getting so embarrassing, isn't it? But one thing at a time. Now we're doing quartz. But this is not okay. Not okay. Right, I'm starting to see the sort of the whole base is coming together nicely. Uh, see, the motors are stacking up here. And we okay, well that's just the way it is. All of this needs to be paved as well. Whoops, that's not what I wanted. Just gonna take a bit of a dent. You know, we might as well do this. Don't know why, but we want this. It's been so long since we went here, but since I have so much of this. Oh, you're full. Never mind. Huh. It's a it's a bit of a shame that once you get beyond this, you don't need it at all. And it's not if there was something late game where you could automatically feed them, then it would be fine. But it, it just feels such a shame that you have all of this biofuel and you get more biofuel and you have literally no purpose to, to bring it. It's just a very, very tiny bit for the... Um, how's this one doing? Oof, poorly is the conclusion. What do you press to drag all of them? I hold control down while uh, dragging it. Last tech before you finish the game, inserter. Ha! Yeah. Could be, could be. Hey, I got one of these. Nice. And Samor doesn't have a purpose. Where's the, the stuff that doesn't work? They go in here. Okay. We have actually quite a lot of things that we still need to, uh, to build in this space. Let's get that again. That one will kill it. And. Watch crystal! Whoop. Let me go back. It's very important that I. This, this one quartz crystal. That is very valuable. Okay. Um, let's have a look at what our research options are. If there's something we haven't really done radar technology, Katerium computer. 50 of these see I could handcraft them but I just feel that it would be such a shame to do that when I'm literally building the quantum oscillator tower right now anything else that we could take mm, nope not that one can you see what the recipe for that is and here is the computers the computers so they're gonna be have to be left for a while uh, here we have shrooms hmm. That should be something we can do. Woohoo! I can complete a research today! Smash the button. Smash it. Yes. Summer Sloop. Alternate iron ingots. I need to find these and I don't have them, so don't care. Right. So, we are going to need more concrete and more iron primarily. Anything else we need? Just chop up the rest. Already topped up, already topped up. This one already topped up. This one, we don't need that for anything. 
That one. This one. Yeah, we'll get it. And here. 200. 200? Yeah. We don't need that much at this point. We are going to need a few, a lot of these. Because we are going to make like our walk, walk path. Our skywalks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Should we take seven of these and then more than seven? How much is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then the last bit should be the concrete. Because we still need some of that. Woo! I need a big inventory. Oh, look at this. Uh, I should have brought more concrete. Because this is annoying. I don't like watching this. Isn't there somewhere else I could take the concrete from? How did you get the rifle? That is uh, research from... From somewhere. <sighs> Sorry, uh, what was the research from? Oh, it's the Nobelisk. You find some sulfur, you research sulfur, you get the uh, research for Nobelisk, you research 10 Nobelisk, and then you get the rifle. I think that's how it, how it goes. Wrong inventory or wrong equipment. That one also has to go. I am aware of it and I agree with it. Huh. We really need some this is this is also annoying. This tree is just eluding me. I kill it regularly, okay. I guess we can't do that. Because of inventory constraint, yeah. You want more of my inventory, but you're not gonna get it. You are not worthy. So this part here really needs to be wider because this is ugly as hell. So also, I don't like running on this part. So let's get this, and I don't think. I don't think that's correct. There we go. So, anyone have any objections about this tower as it is now? Because speak now or forever hold your peace. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That is what it is. Nine here, here, and we go. That one is a two, that's a three, and that's a four somehow. Boom, boom, four, five, six. Love it, not so natural. Thank you, that was the correct answer. It was a rhetorical question, as it always is in at weddings as well. Like, well, I actually wanted to bang the the bride one last time. It's like, no, no, you, you're not supposed to say that. It's pure formality. Oh, oh, oh. Never mind then. Don't mind me. Hey, Extrason, good evening. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. Two, three, four, five, six. What is up? The sky is up. And the space elevator is up. That's what is up right now. And the firmament upon which the stars are fastened is also up. <clears throat> yes. And um, in terms of if you wanted a better answer than that, then uh, I am building a quant the, oh, a quartz oscillator. Now, what's it called? Is it called a quantum oscillator or whatever it's called? Oops. I don't know. It's, it's something something with quartz and it's going to be nice and it's going to be useful. Bro, what's up, dude? Well, Exorcism, isn't the whole point that the firmament is all around you? Because what is it then called where where you fasten the carpet of uh, of stars and other celestial objects? 
Isn't that also the firmament? Because the firmament is where you fasten everything to. I mean, don't, don't really... I mean, I, I don't put that much effort into... Uh, this. Oh yeah, by the way, we found out that it was so much easier to build this before and not after. Now I built this, which is really... Before I add the... Here. Go away. And this one as well. We'll take these out and figure out what we're gonna do with it afterwards. Uh, a new subscriber. Ah, that arrives. is a lovely sound. It fills you with determination. A sound that I have noticed we hear rarely when playing satisfactory, but more often when playing Factorio. Hmm. Is that a coincidence? No, it's not. Thank you very much, Harrington, for the four month streak. Thank you. I just love your Factorio and Satisfactory videos and streams to keep up the good work. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I will try my very best to keep up my good work. Or at least keep up my work. Uh, this is wasteful because you will you will be overriding it. Always up against the sun. We found out that it was easy to do this. Okay, not that easy apparently. Before I place the the floor in here. So that's what we're gonna do. I, you backed Firmament on Kickstarter. <laughs> I would imagine that the the Firmament has a more of a divine sponsor than uh, than than is necessary on Kickstarter. But then again, Lord works in mysterious ways, and maybe Kickstarter is one of them would be kind of odd. Anyone watch that um, new show on... Is it an HBO? I think it is. Miracle Workers, I think it's called. With Daniel Radcliffe and Steve Buscemi? Steve Buscemi as God and Daniel Radcliffe as, a, as an angel. It has so much potential and it is so poorly made. So I would not recommend it. It's a cool concept. And, and but it's so poorly executed. It's really like the cheapest, worst actors. They they get to play all the supporting supporting roles. So I mean, it's like yeah, it's okay. And I have to say this uh, so that when I give any recommendations um, to we don't freak out the, the good cabbage that uh, there are no man-eating pussies in this one. So it is safe for you and your family to watch. That's just a fair warning. Why are you freaking out, my friend? Is it the chair? Then Radcliffe. Oh, did you did you guys watch the Swiss Army Man? That is such a good movie. Really good. Oh, the horn is really. It's it's such an awesome movie. Just don't look at it as a big movie. Just look at it sort of like a a niche thing that is. It's really. Mm -hmm. I'm such a fan of, of anything he has done post um, post Harry Potter. Hey, this tower is going to be looking real nice. Or mighty fine even. I don't know if it's the best way to build this first. He's so short, I can't get over it. <laughs> well, I think he uh, he gets his uh, share of whatever he wants a share of, despite his size. I am pretty sure of it. The funny thing is he always gets confused with that with Elijah Wood and the other way around as well. So they're like, <laughs> I saw something with the, 
Then Radcliffe, where he was like, he had to sign it with like Lord of the Rings books and stuff like that. <laughs> and Elijah Wood was talking about how he was like, oh yeah, you're great in Harry Potter. I was like, never mind, I'm just whatever. And this is where the stupidity comes in because I just built all of this and now I realize that really I probably shouldn't. I don't need anything out here. So why don't we make it try to make it somewhat different from the other ones, right? So we make a nice slope out here. I'm still going to eat my way through all the stuff I just built. That sucks. It looks like that actually could work, at least to this level. And probably not further because then we need this one. Whoa, totally not what I want. Ugh, this is not good. What am I doing? I don't know. I have honestly no idea. I just felt this would be a good idea. So that we would have like a slope up to a slope location. I'm being way more interested in closing these off than I was in the beginning because I think it's gonna look so much nicer. And now we need all the beautiful stuff we did. So, sort of like this. Now it already starts connecting a bit more. What? Binary Codex Gaming? What? You were kidding about what? Ooh. Holy cat, generous Davies is Gimli. Yeah, he is a very, uh, he's a big guy. See grass on the concrete? I don't see any grass on the concrete. I see some green concrete. <clears throat> yeah, so we have a tower-ish. Let's start building the next part. Hey, Brody, my good evening. I do realize that it must be a game and not uh, <laughs> an actually uh, celestial model. Three, four, five, six. But even then, I am a very open-minded per person. No, I'm not. <laughs> Who am I kidding? <laughs> you know me. I am not open-minded in any way, shape or form. So. Oops, should not have done that. And just an update for um, for people. Then I have started work on new emotes and have showed some samples to uh, some of the regular members. So uh, for input, um, we're not quite there yet. So I'm not going to release something or show something that I'm not happy with. But just so you know, that will be coming new emotes. Now I've been talking about it for a long time, but I'm starting to see some. Some uh, inputs of it, outputs of it, inputs, outputs. There you go. I am sure we need. Oh, this is brilliant. I forgot that. It was actually going. No, it's going on the other side of this tower, right? No, it's just going before. The oh, this is lovely. This is perfect. That's another tower that's pretty close to uh, that. Lovely. Awesome. Hey, Skelly Cat Gaming. Good evening. Kind of running out of things. 
already. Looks like it's the concrete we're running out of because some idiot decided to pave the world instead of focus on the tower. I don't know. I don't know who that might be. You know what? I got another idea, and it's a bet. It's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good one. Luckily, tomorrow is Ascension Day. Yeah, is it Ascension Day? Oh, right. It's called Ascension Day. That's what it's called. All right. Yep. Yep. I mean, it's it's something with Christ. I mean, his resurrection, right? Ah, uh, so it looks, it seems like uh, Saint Cabbage is even less godly than I am, since he he was confusing it with the the day when he was crucified, right? So yeah, I took a Friday off too, and although I work land party at the weekend, oh, that sounds so nice. I was just wondering, can you somehow do an advanced tutorial for Factorio trains and other stuff? And uh, no. <laughs> I think that if I said yes, then it would take about two seconds before Hapos would tell me I was not qualified to speak about trains. So, I don't know. I think I might not be qualified to talk about trains. Rumor has it, I don't know how trains work, and I don't know how signaling works, so, um... I'm doing it all wrong. Is that a holiday on your side of it? Yes, it is! Yeah, Extrason, I would also... Be very surprised if you decided to celebrate anything related to uh, Jesus Christ where you are located. That would um, be quite a surprise, but I'd yes. And this is not the right way because that's really not getting us anywhere. And that way. You guys know what I'm doing? Just does it make sense to you? Or have you just gotten used to not having a clue what the hell I'm doing and just having me as background noise? Please don't say yes. Breaking the religion, oh, all the religion chatter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're talking national holidays. I think the. Okay, so let's. The best national holiday we have in Denmark is the Great Prey Day, which is the literal translation. That is just very classical. Uh, the the old uh, monarchs would just say, I don't give a shit about all your saints. You get one day and you can pray to whatever you like on that day, but the rest of the year you work. Brilliant. Brilliant, right? How much can we tune this? Well, we can tune it a bit. Ah, why are they not in my inventory anymore? Because I'm an idiot. I'm in valid shape. Yes, I know it's in valid shape, but it's not really something I can do anything about. What? Uh, but the HTN setup in the community map makes me want to tear the whole thing down and put an LTN. Oh, Jay Dredder, you, you are my favorite person in the whole world today. <laughs> exactly, Hurtian. I mean, it's this is in Denmark, the spring is like, oh, so there's no work on tomorrow? Oh, awesome. And there's like couple of weeks ago was a Friday off and then the tomorrow is off and then next there's also a Monday the 17th of June or something and the no, 17th of May was off and there's one more in two weeks time with like the national day Uh, 
and let's see. Now, how am I going to do this? Because I can't... This cannot be made into a normal thing, right? So, one, two, three, four. Can I do this? <sighs> See, that doesn't work. Stupid invalid shape. I'm getting desperate here. How can how can this not work? Mm. And then maybe this one, I guess. Good. Always, always, always. You know what? One, two, four. How can I not get this correct? What if we take it here? One, two. There, that's the closest we can get. And this one. can take some of this out. We can take it closer. And you can go closer. This is just all... I do all of this crap just so I don't have to go back and get some more concrete. Which is completely absurd because obviously it would be a lot faster. Uh, what? Oh yeah, that sucks. This is no way that this can ever be looking good, can it? What if I just did this? <laughs> I ran out. I ran out. A new subscriber there. Hey, Sir Crunk. Builds you with determination. Thank you for the three months. And thank you for extending your stay around here. See? That's going to be good. Can we allow... Can we accept this? One, two... The problem is this one. I can't do anything about it. What? How what am I going to do this something about it? Okay, but we can't have poor extrasense eyes spraying blood if it's my fault. So that would that I can't have that on my conscience. So we'll do it uh, less efficient but slightly less awful. Alright, Extrason, how are your eyes feeling? Are they are they feeling better? Are they okay? <laughs> yeah. Uh, keep me on the straight and narrow, that's for sure. But man, it's gonna be awful. Yes, sir. Thank you. Well, <sighs> yep. Keep me on the straight and narrow. That's true. That's someone's got to do it, right? And now I wonder, is this? Well, obviously it's out, but it's not encroaching, so that's good. All right, we're gonna box this in somehow. And uh, if we can find a way to get power somewhere. 
Where the hell is the power up there? Maybe it's not even there. And I have one power pole left. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna munch that one as well. We're ready. Uh, oops, not a good time to do it. We're gonna have one mark there, but if I do that, then it's not gonna work. So I'm gonna put it. Oh, it's encroaching on that one's clearance, really. Okay. Can you just get up there? Yeah, you can do it. That's fine. Concrete and concrete. Let's see. So now this one can only take 80. Oh, this is 60. That's pathetic. So this one actually needs to be scaled up. That's horrible. I thought it was a good location. But it was not. And then it just needs to go into a... I guess I have to do it this way. For sort of consistency state sake. That one. This one. One, two. Good. And then somehow... Oh, that's pretty bad. You s running around with this in my hand. It's pretty awful. There. What? Hands off. One. Two. Get a... This one? Or... Good one. Can I? I can't keep it in there. Ta -da! Everyone's happy. And this is just chugging along, and eventually, maybe. It, why is this one so dead? No power. Well, that's a good excuse for being so dead. Uh, that one to... There we go. Alright. Yep, it is a bit frantic, but it works. It works. And we go over here and get lovely 20. Not much. It's not much, I tell you, but it's something. Did I ever tell you that the motto of my department back when I was a corporate manager was it's something and I thought that was I was actually really happy that we first of all we had a motto and we used it like actively it was really cool to uh, it was a good motto to have because things just were never perfect and but it wasn't perfect, but it was something, right? It was something. It was enough to get us going and things worked. Lovely! Okay, I couldn't even get up there. Uh, right! Well, that's not gonna do much because, yeah, reasons. And I need to get back up there, but I am kind of. kind of sucks. Let's also clear some more of this. Just thought of something. If I'm a member of the order, but does that make me a patho pathological? <laughs> Maybe. And we even have a little, uh, a little uh, mascot. And some of them were saying that it was me, but it's it's one of those uh, troll faces that was just jumping in a ballet pose. Um, and that became, and we just wrote it's something below it. It's like it was really cool. And it was totally non-compliant, non-corporate, and we just put it everywhere we could get away with, and just waited for someone to uh, to tell us we were not allowed. And, and it was just, it was just one of those things where, where we knew it was wrong, but it was just, why can't we have fun? And I knew it was just so many people that were pissed off by it. I had complaints because there was someone called Anos, and that's. Uh, 
a Danish name for Donald Duck. So his uh, icon was Donald Duck. And then someone was complaining to me and said, that was really unprofessional to have a Donald Duck icon. Like, really? Is it? Is it though? <laughs> Does it matter? <laughs> If you have it on your uh, your Jira profile, is that really something that has to be corporate compliant? The answer was yes. But that's just good old times, right? Good old times. There we go. We can now get up. I'll just yeah, do one more. Just one more. Just one more. There we go. Just one more. Just one more. Look at this. That was a little enclave of. Uh, of concrete here. Lovely, I like it. Hmm. And now we wait. No, we don't. Shut up with that. Still don't like this way of working. I still don't like it. Modest fellowship expands. Praise the sub. <laughs> Spanko the cows? <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Welcome and thank you very much for supporting our little endeavor here. Oh, I have to remember to set up my brakes and swipe right, swipe right, swipe right, swipe right. There we go. Set up the brakes. And your oh your companion cube. I've, I've, I love that you can, you should be able to have like, just things that don't matter should not matter, for the sake of of just seeming professional. It's like who are we kidding with the whole appearing professional? Because you're not going to be a better or a worse developer because you're having fun. Well, you're probably going to be worse because you're not having fun. And everything has to be. Oh crap. So damn corporate compliant. There we go. Did I pick up myself and my kids in a cockpit of a fighter trainer in museum? If they complain about it being unprofessional, I'll tell them to go away. Yep, I did so as well. And now I'm a full time YouTuber streamer. Whoops. <laughs> so as long as you are uh, willing to, to do that sacrifice, then fine. And I can't do these because they need... Well, okay, cannibalize. I got the whole uh, severance thing settled with my old company. It's completely done now. And uh, I'm of course not going to talk about it. But I can say that uh, I sent flowers to the lawyer who uh, helped me, uh, who negotiated it for me. So that should also say something. It was just such a nice experience having a lawyer on your side. Who really could bully the bullies. That was awesome. It's just nice to get that out of the way. So there's, there's like complete resolved. I have nothing to talk to the about at all. Four, five, six. You're in your position before telling Corbett to go away. Yeah, yeah, or just don't give a shit. <laughs> Either confident or or, uh, or careless. That's the thing, right? Foolishness and courage, they can look very, very similar. Sometimes it's hard to tell one from the other. All right, that was not a total waste. Oh, not you. Okay, we have tons of these, so we can definitely and should definitely continue with this. While we let our new fancy concrete plant just Generate away tons and tons of concrete, like seven or something.
There, so at this level I will be crunching the quartz and doing some other things. We also need we need cables, so I'm gonna get iron in, smelt the iron, maybe do some more, and then go up. So we definitely need one more floor. We oops, there we go. All the servers of my old jobs were named after Looney Tunes. Yeah, just a taste of madness. It's really nice. Uh, oh, was it tier two? Ooh, no, it wasn't tier two. What did I did I look stupid? I mean, don't. Uh, don't don't answer that, right? What what happened? The tier two came later. Huh? But he he did get it. First prime, then tier two. Oh right. Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, wow. Thank you for just uh, upgrading so fast. That is amazing. Thank you. So, to what do we owe the honor? Thank you, Mort. And thank you, Mort, for uh, just reminding me when I, when I missed it. That is very kind. Being cool. Thank you. You, that is. Three, four, five. Six. I'm not particularly cool. All I can do is count to six. But I do it really, really well. Really, really well. Actually, I don't count to six really well. What I'm doing here is just burning through some of our iron rods and iron plates. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. this. Don't you have a dedicated cable building? Nope, I don't have a dedicated cable building. Cable building is what I would call like a basic component. Therefore, I don't, I build them on site one. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know it's a bit inconsistent, but I'm basically saying anything from reinforced iron and up is going to go you're going to have a dedicated location, but anything less than that is not. It's really strange that we built the walkways before we built the floors. Okay, that was close. No fails here. Like this? Yeah, I think that's fine. And I can't check chat while I'm doing this. Oh. Who the hell built that one while I was looking the other way? Okay, then you forgot the power pole halfway point. Yep, I did forget. The, well, I didn't forget. I ignored it because I can't really proceed without building this. I know I'm going to have to take it down, but I've taken it down so many times before that I feel that it's still better to do this. Because I just don't have the concrete, uh, not the concrete, but the, well, the concrete, yes, to build my way up there. Just yet, so I'm gonna build this thing. Four, five, six. I really wouldn't mind having some more different music. It's it's good, but there are not enough tracks. Two, three, four, five, six. Factorio has twelve tracks I think and I have not gotten tired of them after 4,000 hours this one has five six tracks or something and it's already starting to sort of yeah okay it's the same one all the time and it's not because of the quality it's simply because of the lack of variety or because 
a lot of it is also only played when you're out in the world so factory building music will only be two or three tracks or something I wouldn't mind having a few more also because Yannick the guy who made the music the composer has made some absolutely fantastic music so let's get some more of that Hey Natsa, good evening. Let me just check, what am I missing? What? My name is Sherlock. Oh, we're talking server names? What? Mm. It's called our diagnostic system house. <laughs> good reference though. The Mr. House from Fallout, New Vegas, with the close well, the house always wins. Ah. I just... Good. And now we are going to... Here we are. That is a adequate place for us to end, not end, obviously. But take a short break, because time is running away from us. We now have our, the founding of our quartz tower. We obviously need a lot more, a uh, lot more concrete to build this, but got plenty of space, right? <laughs> I think it, I, I wouldn't want to pay Factorio music over here, but I could. But I, I don't know. There's also the whole thing about having like other soundtracks in the background. I don't know about that, but I haven't really looked into it. Oh, it looks like an X-wing. Oh, it is. That's actually cool. It does look like an X-wing, and not intentional. But um, if it was intentional, I wouldn't be able to make something that looked like anything. So it's only by happenstance. And let me remember how we do this, because in this game we just add, remove my ugly mug and put a timer there instead. So let's do that. I will take a three minute break, so see you guys in three minutes. <laughs> 